An Alaska veteran on Monday was recognized again for heroic actions he took while in combat 14 years ago in Afghanistan. His sacrifice continued to be honored by the U.S. Army. Georgina Fernandez takes us inside the gates to learn more. It's a day Brian Sear never imagined. 11th never. Division. Never. Almost ceremony. 14 years later. We are here today to honor Mr. Brian Sear for his heroic actions on November 6, 2009. U.S. Army retiree Sear was awarded the third highest military decoration for valor in combat. We are here this morning to witness the presentation of the Silver Star Medal. In 2009, Sears' actions while deployed in Afghanistan. I resupplied some infantry guys because they were pinned down. Earned him the Bronze Star Medal with Valor, which he was awarded in 2010. Now almost a decade and a half later. The Silver Star may be given to any one of the individual services for a singular acts of valor or heroism over a brief period in support of combat missions of the United States military. That medal was upgraded after officials reviewed and recognized he deserved a higher award for his actions. He left that covered position to advance on the enemy, to suppress enemy positions and actually ultimately uh, destroy them. Um, and he exposed himself three separate times. So not just once, went out there and did it twice, three times. But for Sear, that November day, he didn't do anything out of the ordinary. I didn't think of anything of it, just let's get the job done. Let's get our guys what they need. Just doing his duty. If he came back down to you tell me today that I would be going back out of the resupply, I'd say yes, because that's just who I am. But now, as a father of three. You know, after having a family now and realizing what I've done and how many other people now can have families, it just made me proud of what I did now. His actions hold a new meaning. My son, you know, he likes playing cops and bad guys, and all of a sudden he's realizing that daddy's a hero. He's just, well, kept on coming up to me, asking me why am I a hero. And if I stopped bad guys, I said, yes, I did. A sacrifice in life-saving mission never forgotten. Inside the gates, Georgina Fernandez, Alaska's news source.